Imagine if Ninja got a low taper fade. Just imagine it. Imagine it. Imagine if Ninja got a low taper fade. <laughs> anyway, uh, hi, how's it going? Oh yeah, I had Eden's Blessing last run, I guess. That, yeah, that, that craziness that happened last run, right, I remember. Um, I, I don't want to go back. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I guess I had Eden's Blessing yesterday, cool. Uh, that's nice. Yeah, you know what, I'll take homing bombs, actually. I don't want to re-roll this, I'll take homing bombs. I'm okay with this, mostly because it just gives me bombs, and having bombs is nice. I like bombs. I can't believe this enemy didn't do any contact damage. Wait, you tell me these motherfuckers don't do contact damage? I'm not gonna put it to the test, obviously. Not right now, I lost my mantle anyway, but that's news to me. Anyway, yeah, like, uh, yesterday's run, huh? That was quite something. I haven't watched it yet. Uh, be sure to. It's one of the most broken runs I've ever had. Definitely. I hope today will be a little bit calmer. I can just play a little, a little lost, enjoy my life, enjoy myself, you know. A little bit more of a calm run. That'd be nice. The bomb. You know what? I will check the shop, actually. Ooh, I see balls. And I can definitely afford them, thanks to this two of diamonds. Two. Boom. <laughs> Oh, yeah, baby. I like the side of this. I wouldn't mind getting Dreamcatcher as well. If I can get a little bit more cash, yes, I probably should have just waited. There's no point in me buying the balls instantaneously, to be fair. I could have just waited until I had the money to buy both of these items and then... Or, like, you know, buy one of them and then d d doubled it, but... Uh, you know, I might undervalue Dreamcatcher a little bit after saying I wouldn't mind having it. But, like, you know, it's probably, it's probably good. Probably good anyway. What makes it larger? Not a fan. You know what? Let's speed this up a little bit. I don't have all day, so I'd prefer if you died quickly. Thank you. I don't need that. Uh, I'm scared of this, but I'll take it. Damage unaffected, range down, HP, I guess, was the other thing that went down, which doesn't matter. You know what? The tears up is nice, and the uh, one of the affected stats being like literally useless to me is also fine. There's no way secrets on that side. Oh my god, it is. I need money. Oh man, I guess I'm not getting doing catcher. A darn shame, a bummer indeed, but I think I'll live. I think I'll be fine. I think I'll be fine imagining if Ninja got a low taper fade. I actually don't even know what that means, by the way. I haven't gotten a haircut in two years. Even when I used to get haircuts, I just let my mom cut my hair because I wasn't particularly interested in anything specific, I would just get like, I think it's called an undercut, so just, you know, basically fucking shave the sides and back to like very low, and then just let the top grow a little bit. But yeah, I've just let my hair grow out for the past like two years, man. Which, incidentally, isn't doing my hairline any favors, mind you. Um, I, I don't know, I mean, I don't know how it is uh, objectively, right? It's, it's hard to have an objective judgment on something you see every day. Uh, I guess I'm good, I guess I'm getting a devil deal here, okay? Uh, Guppy's, Gupp, Guppy's cat, dead cat is unavoidable, you have to take it. Uh, you know, like, I think letting my hair grow out isn't doing it any favors because I actually hate having my long hair flopping around, so I tie it up with a hair tie, right? Pretty basic shit. The problem is because it's always slicked back like that, you see my big forehead a lot more. Now, I've always had a big forehead. I don't think this is just a receding hairline and male pattern baldness setting on in my mid-twenties. Part of it, probably. I'd have to actually compare how much it has changed in the past, like, say, five years. I haven't really paid attention to that. Because I always used to have pretty, like, forehead-revealing uh, haircuts. <laughs> more, more or less, like, you know, I used to either slick, slick back the hair or just have, like, short-ass hair. So, you know, you would always see my forehead. So I guess I could compare, but in, in, in my opinion, I remember even as a kid, I used to have a pretty big forehead all the time. So I'm just under the impression that it's just not doing me any favors. A D4, absolutely not. I would much rather spend my cash on just random shit in here. I know I can't really use converter all that much, and I should have probably re-rolled, but oh well. Yeah, that would have happened, so it might be for the better. Yeah, converter doesn't even do anything for me. A D6 in this room, that's... Very cruel. A d20 in this room, not as cool. So, uh, yeah, you know. I started out with just, like, like, still, like, the classic, like, shaving the sides and back. And, like, letting the top grow out and then doing, like, a man bun thing. But now I've just let the sides grow out as well because it's... I don't like the maintenance, you know. Can you die, please, Min-Min? Thank you. That was getting a bit dicey. I love me the tear right out of this. I've already been in here. Nothing of note. Um, I, I guess I'm done with the fucking floor. There's, there's nothing else, yeah? I'm just going, okay. Now I could look for my other secret room, but what's what's the point? <laughs> what's what's the point? What do you get out of it, you know? You know, it's a second syringe 
Fuck it. It do be a second syringe. I'm not a huge fan of taking it. Love warm friend right now, by the way. Just holding that guy in place. Absolutely wonderful stuff. I gotta find stuff to use this on, man. Bag of crafting? Hell nah. Spin to win? Hell nah, but at least it does more for me than... Technically, it does more for me than, um... Uh, converter, so, you know, I guess I'll carry it. it. It theoretically has a use. It's not a very practical or good use, but it technically has one. Plus, passively, it just gives me an orbital, which uh, is nice, I guess. God, I wish I didn't have Curse of the Lost so I could teleport. Oh, well, what can you do? Roll again. Pointy rib? Mm, I can do better than that. Mm, yeah, yeah. Mm, yeah, I can do better than that. I should not be stingy with my rerolls here. I have plenty available to me. Oh boy, man, these shops keep being pretty freaking good. I just need to actually get the money for this tarot cloth. But I think that will be very much feasible in my in my future. Also, unfortunately for me, this old chestnut isn't here to last. Like my my dice bag is going to go away. Wait a minute, I have infinite charges on this floor. Ah, oh, curse you, curse of the lost! Why are you like this? Now I actually have to walk around all the time and oh man. Wait at energy. Lock up. Well, I guess I'll just keep re-rolling. Friend zone ain't all that. Boom. Yeah, that's useless. Dude, I'm gonna go insane. Not being able to teleport because of the lack of fucking everything. Whatever, I'll just grab this for now. At least it's a small floor, so it's not that bad. Could be worse. Could be a large ass floor and I'd, I'd be in way more trouble. Yes. Get locked up. Worm versus worm. Who wins? Is he gonna do the poke? He is. Okay. Unfortunate. Can you please stay out? Thank you. I just want to kill you, man. Like, fucking hell. Okay, what do we got? Ooh, I should have gotten in here with a dice bag, but it's fine. I can get a guppy item, which is good by me. Roll this. It's gone. Cool. <laughs> awesome. Now, here I go. Looking for this damn battery. I really hope it can't spawn on the mirror side. Let's be honest. It probably can. Oh, shit. That's good. Okay. I can live with this. Uh, well, I got some natty charges to be getting, so... Boom! Nope. <laughs> it's quite literally, but nope. I, I don't want that either. Like, what is a low taper fade? It's just, like, the way the, the sides are cut, I guess, right? Ah, fuck. Stupid worm friend making this making this harder than it should be. He's been so useful the entire time, but he screwed me over this one time. That's, that's what, like... Fade is the- I know fade is like if you have like the sides of your head, but it's like, you know, it fades out the hair a little bit. Like it's thicker at the top and then like you shave more and more as you get down or something like that. Uh, I think that's what a fade is, if I remember right. But what's a taper? What's a low taper mean in this- in this context, you know? That's what I don't know. <laughs> that's what I don't understand and that's why I'm asking. I'm sure there's some barbers slash hairdressers, uh... Or whatever the profession is called nowadays because everything that you know every profession that uh or used to be gendered now has to be neutral because you you know that's how it'd be uh where's my damn battery at by the way don't tell me it already disappeared I'll, I'll grab this anyway i could also just get a guaranteed charge out of this you know what yeah that'll do is it still mostly common that male barbers cut men's hair and vice versa is, is that is that how that works still for the most part like you know women probably know more about women's hair and how to dress it or whatever, so they, you know, end up cutting other women's hair and stuff like that. Man, you tell me the fucking golden battery disappeared, really? There's no shot, right? It must be on the mirror side somewhere. Oh, there it is. I knew you would be somewhere. I knew I wouldn't have just lost you like that, my beloved golden battery. That being said, this is the last roll I'm doing. I'm so glad the item disappeared to just reinforce my decision to make that the last roll. Let's go. Let's just leave. Let's get that out of here. Let's get let's skedaddle. I want to actually be able to see my map again. I probably wasted like an extra five minutes on that floor just because I couldn't teleport. There we go. That's more like it. Roll that immediately. Both items disappeared. Yeah, hate to see it. Yeah, absolutely hate to see it. Tears up, shots beat down. Uh, again, only positives out of that one. Dude, I'm getting cash. They're trying to fuel my keeper sack plays here, man. I love it. Does Ninja still actually have the blue hair? I know I'm just going to talk about it, but like that, that video just lives in my head rent free right now, man. Can you imagine if Ninja got a low taper fade? <laughs> he still has the blue hair, right? He had pink hair at some point, didn't he? I'm not seeing enough movement. <laughs> I actually don't know what Ninja's up to now. He still plays Fortnite, right? He still does Fortnite. <laughs> Career suicide and all that. His numbers ain't been the same since he came back to Twitch after Mixer died, right? Which I, I think still was like a good business decision, though. Him just like getting paid millions of dollars to go to Mixer and then the platform fucking like literally shuts down or gets sold or some shit before his contract even ran out 
That's very funny. There's there's something truly comedic about that. This guy's got no haircut, man. He's bald as fuck. I actually need to pay more attention to that, man. How many Isaac characters or whatever enemies actually have hair? Not even most of Isaac and his, like, you know, alter egos have hair, man. The last doesn't, but he's like a ghost. I'll just take the cards, man. I got tarot cloth. These are probably gonna be good. Two of clubs does not double it twice, which is weird. Inverted hermit. Does the inverted hermit spawns one additional penny? Okay. You know what? Sure. Fuck it. Just turn these into money. I can spend that on useful stuff like uh, a shop, which would do a lot for me, probably. The more interesting question is: I know people still play Fortnite. Do people still watch Fortnite? Is Fortnite still like a big thing? I don't like check with the general Twitch meta or anything like that anymore, right? Do people like still even watch Fortnite? Is that still like a big deal, or do you think like most of the people that used to religiously watch Fortnite or something like that are you know grown out of it? Good pills. Don't mind if I do. I kind of want to buy four and a half volt just because it's probably good as well. But oh well, I can see forever. Sure. I'm not the biggest fan of four and a half volt, but the na the simple nature of the fact that I get stats out of buying it makes it a worthwhile purchase. Again, there's almost no downside severe enough for me to not want to get damage. So I I'm getting tele pills everywhere, and we're done. Okay. Let me grab this. I can see forever. Why not? That seems like a fun thing to have. And we move down. Speaking about internet oldies, I guess, already. <laughs> this one, this one's a bit weird if you haven't heard about it, but bear with me. Did you see that Verbalaze, uh, in case you're not familiar with who Verbalaze is, Verbalaze is the guy that made, like, the fucking beatbox rap battles. Like, you, you seen that video of Thanos beatboxing? Yeah. Yeah, he's, he's that guy. Did you see that he, he spent 50 grand on a self-insert commissioned video of him and that girl from Hasbun Hotel, like, not even fucking, but it's like, it's like a, it's like a music video. You know, like, they're implied fucking. Um, and it bankrupted him? Like, not only did my man spend 50 grand on that, which is already insane, but, you know, people spend money on insane things all the time. This isn't necessarily out of the, like, you know, completely out there. Uh, specific commissions go hard. Oh yeah, damage. But the fact that it bankrupted him is so funny. Apparently he used money that he got from a fundraiser that he was using or like intending to use for something, but he just like spent 50 grand on that and now he's got no money left. Also, apparently he's like 40. Also, apparently he's a, like he loves Andrew Tate. <laughs> There's a lot of wrinkles that get added on after something like that happens. Like, you know, like at first it's like, this is kind of fucking like funny, but also a little sad. Like bro spent 50 grand on something. Like he spent a new car's worth of money on something that, you know, no reasonable person should ever spend money on, which is already funny as hell. But, you know, I didn't know you could take those bombs out of the rooms with you, that's cool. Uh, but, you know, that's that's like, that's like one thing. But then, you know, there, there's just more shit added on, like, he's actually 40, which is, you know, like, sure, like, older people are on the internet now, and, like, being 40 means that you were, like, 20 when the internet started kicking off, sure. But still, a bit strange. Uh, but then <laughs> going fully bankrupt because of it, like literally spending all the money you have on that commission is very funny. And to top it off, the uh, extra wrinkles, like uh, he's a fucking true degenerate apparently. It's it's just... <sighs> There's so much, so much funny about it. I feel a little bad. I mean, bro's getting ridiculed on the internet now. That's kind of what happened, right? The video's been taken down, people have been re-uploading it. Ooh, birthright. Uh, why, thank you. Habit does nothing for me. I guess I'll just delete it then. That's a that's a damn that's a, a damning thing, man. That digital footprint. It's it's got people all kinds of twisted up, man. You don't want to fuck around with those digital footprints. It's what I'm talking about, man. You gotta be real careful with what you make on the internet. Even if it seems cool to you, there's a good chance that shit will not fly. Like what I'm seeing now is like this is what kids were doing back in the day as well, right? Whenever I'm scrolling down like Instagram or something like that, I sometimes just randomly get like a random ass video from just like a 12 year old kid that's like trying to do something that they might have seen in another video or TikTok or something like that, right? And they're just like, they're just having fun with it. But it's obviously cringe because it's a kid doing it and like they don't really understand where the joke lies or why it's funny. Sometimes, like it's very rare that a kid will actually, you know, manage to make a genuinely good joke or something like that. Because they're just figuring it all out. They like, they understand something is funny, but they don't really understand why it's funny necessarily, right? I was like that as a kid. Like back in the day, like you'd have like, you know, kids posting shit like that on YouTube. You'd have like, uh, kids just like posting, posting random stuff on YouTube and that's what YouTube was. It was the platform people to post random home videos it's nowhere near similar nowadays it's something completely vastly transformed and different but you know that's what it used to be and now we've got like a whole new generation of kids doing that exact shit but unlike tiktok and like instagram and like getting like you know promoted like with 
a, a vast algorithm that's just sharing stuff. I know Bloody Lust is... Lusty Blood is actually good for me, or like at least it does something, but I'm also very tempted to just re-roll. That being said, I could also just get rid of uh, this, and there you go. Yeah! Damocles, of course! Not even a question in my mind, of course I'm taking that. Uh, might as well use the 48 hour energy roll this. Love the damage up. Absolutely wonderful. It's a bit late for Damocles, but it's not too late to apologize. So, yeah, I guess I'll just go. They're like, there's kids out there just like making like random meme videos. Like, they're obviously just, like, in their room, they're not really doing much at all, the parents have no idea what's happening. Same shit I was doing when I was a kid, except I didn't put myself in front of a camera, because I had, like, you know... At least in, in, in terms of that, back then, I was always told by my parents, like, oh, be careful what you do on the internet, don't put pictures of yourself out there, there's fucking freaks out there, you know? You know what, just fucking use the brimstone here, that's gonna make your life a lot easier. You don't have to worry about a thing. Digital footprints, kids, uh, kids going crazy, or, uh, 40-year-olds that... It's just like, it's such an unfathomable amount of money. $50,000 is such an insane amount of money for a less than three minute long animation that ends up being nothing more than like a self-insert fanfiction, like erotic thing. That's so fucking crazy, man. Like, what do you mean you could have like bought a new car for this fucking money, man? Brimstone, these fuckers. Oh, it's such an insane tier rate, man. And because of 4.5 Volt, I could use it twice. I'm not gonna use it twice this fight, because there's no point. But it is cool. It is cool that I can do that. Lots of tier rate. I've been getting so many tiers ups that break the tiers gap, man. It's crazy. There's my item room. Right. Yeah, I'm gonna take Monstro's Lung. Because I'm pretty sure... Yeah, they all just get bunched into the beam. That's cool as hell. Uh, give me a conjoined piece. Why not? I would re-roll here normally, but you know. I actually don't mind getting conjoined when I have tractor beam. Well, plus there's a library down here instead. That's what I guess I can use my charges on. Roll everything. Surprised nothing got deleted. That's truly incredible. A true shame indeed. <laughs> now everything got deleted. All right. I understand. I understand. I, I spoke too soon and now I fucked around and found out. Mm, you know what? I'll actually take this. And I'll take this too. I don't think it makes my brimstone fatter, but right, the, the tractor beam doesn't exist anymore now, I think. Unless it's only... it's still there, but like non-visually. No, it's definitely not there anymore. I seem to be getting this brimstone monstrous lung synergy quite a lot lately. I'm not complaining, I think it's really cool. Um, it's, it's, it's neat to have, but it, it do be showing up quite frequently. <laughs> With surprising, striking frequency. Alright, tears right uh, out of this, that's cool. Actually, never mind, no tear rate. At all. But I'll take the damage out of this. Can you imagine if Ninja got a low tip? <laughs> I need to stop talking about it, man. I need to stop that right now. Oh boy! Lots of stuff. Well, again, I want to go for conjoined pieces. The rest... Mm, well, homing rockets actually sounds kind of cool. If I end up getting fucking Dr. Fetus now, I, I'll take it, man. I don't know how the hell it's going to work with, uh, you know, tractor beam and all the other shenanigans going on, but... Uh, that's Hemolacria, okay. Charge rate significantly worse, but... You know. Oh, and more infinite charges as well. Great. Abs absolutely wonderful. Uh, Parasite. Yeah, let's just make this... Let's just make this really ridiculous so the game can crash as soon as possible. Yeah, that seems like a good idea. Alright, I should have charged up a shot before going in here. Matter of fact, hold on. Let's do it with Brim. Oh my god, dude! Yeah, it glitches out quite a bit. <laughs> uh, yeah, um... Sure. Sh sure. It's just a little ridiculous. Uh, there's nothing else to reroll, is there? I guess there's only this to left to reroll. And I do have infinite charges at the end of the day, so why wouldn't I at least buy some stuff, you know? Get the stats out of it for the time being. Wheel of Fortune, absolutely not happening. Problem is now, I don't know where the battery went. I need to go looking in every single room for it. There it is. Thank God it's easy to teleport around like that so quickly. Boom. Uh, more options doesn't do anything for me anymore, unfortunately. Okay, whatever, we're done. Well, let's just fight the boss, I guess. Let's charge up a shot, and uh, she's gonna die in one hit. I almost assure you. Ah, uh, close. I got a charge, though, that's nice. Kind of what I was hoping for. Up, because I'm the last. Unfortunately, that's kind of like a must in that, in that scenario. That is just a good item that I should take without even hesitating. Let's go. Yeah, this shit lags the game. It's, it's the monstrous lungs energy kind of working hand in hand with some other stuff. It's kind of weird. I don't need any of this. I don't need that either. Sure, whatever. Charge up a shot. Just in case. But sometimes some of my bullets just kind of disappear. So that's cool. <laughs> I guess I'm hitting the projectile cap already. Which is a scary proposal. Well, here we go. 
Should probably charge the shot up before coming in here, but I wanted to use the brim. And now it doesn't really matter anymore. I just gotta dodge until I inevitably kill her. Yep. Uh, get me out of here, please. Thank you all. It's a scary place to be when that shit just starts going crazy. An item out of this, which is good enough. Which means it's two items, actually. And I'll grab this one and reroll the other one. Oh my lord. Let me get, let me get my shot off, please. There you go. Now I'm not really worried anymore because every wave is just gonna die instantly. Because this shit lasts fucking ages. And I've got an RGB brimstone now, which is pretty cool. I also got Jacob's Ladder now, which is pretty cool. Charge it fully, then pop brim, which only makes it take half as long to charge. And there you go, he's dead. <laughs> uh, I almost walked into the void portal, don't do that. Get into the chest, man. I mean, I don't mind doing the void, but I'd rather like do this floor first, you know? There's like a bunch of goodies here for me. Ah, uh, that's a great use for my money. Deadeye is also incredible, and I get conjoined. Uh, a lot of good stuff happening here. Might as well grab this. Do I care about Conehead? Nah, let's reroll. Oh, uh, Chalky Milk! Okay, now I can let my charges go at any point. Which is very good. <laughs> very, very helpful. Not having to charge fully anymore. Uh, tech point 5 is also incredible. Might as well reroll this. Uh, sure, you know what? Why not? We got Tech point 5 to help me out in between charges and stuff. That's nice. Lodestone is an incredible item. Might as well reroll this. Kitten Mega Bean is whatever. Boom. Alright. I'll just keep doing this for a while. Loads of items out of this, though. And I'm rolling them all when I get the chance. Because I... As much as my reflection is cool, I don't want it. Sure, give me more luck. I don't think I can get more tier 8. And I have conjoined already, so who cares. Dude, I'm gonna drop the nastiest fucking full charge barrage of brimstones and shit on Mega Satan. Wait, I... Yeah, no. On <coughs> Mega Satan? Uh, it's gonna be crazy, bro. You're not gonna be ready. It's one of the few boss fights where you get some preparation time before fighting. So, you know... Like, you get to just go off. Sure, rubber cement. Let's make this even wackier. Go even crazier with uh, the tier effects that will just make stuff happen. Ah, that's an R key. I'm not taking the R key. I'm sorry. I want this run to end. I don't want to go on forever. Uh, okay, I'll take a Tech X, though, and a Fruitcake for sure as well. Um, these are all gone now. Okay, cool. Yeah, my my Tech Point 5 just creates Tech X rings now for some reason. I guess it spawns tiers that then spawn... That turn into Hamo tiers that then spawn Tech X rings. Uh, yeah, I think that's what's happening here. I think I'm just having too many synergies <laughs> interacting with one another, and they're kind of breaking shit for me a little bit. Uh, might as well reroll this. No, I don't need odd much. Yeah, sure, why not? Who cares, right? And I even have to, like, actually shoot my charge shot. It doesn't matter. Tech point five by itself is more than enough to kill pretty much everything. Apple is pretty good, especially considering I got 14 luck. Uh, yep. I'm not even gonna charge a full shot here. Yeah, it's- it's unnecessary. Bro dies instantaneously anyway. Sure, more tier 8 out of that. <clears throat> anyway, wow. That's- that's crazy, bro. Wow, how did this happen? Anyway, let's charge a full fucking shot. It's gonna take a while. Um, just give me a second here. I know, like, the, the rest is already going. Uh, yeah. Don't- don't worry about me, um, I'm so glad you've given me this time, Mega Satan. I'm very happy about the fact that you are letting me- <laughs> You're letting me go at my own pace here. I respect that. And I respect that you respect me. The real recognizes real and all that. Anyway, uh, I hope I only have to fire this one shot for it to end. Yeah, there's no way this isn't gonna continue shooting forever. Um, this is a perpetual motion machine. I haven't done anything yet. I might as well use uh, fucking, yeah, Sulfur again for more damage. Just keep using it. It's just gonna keep perpetuating itself. He's in phase two now. I have not pressed anything since I first shot, except for a space bar. The only thing I have done since the start of the fight, since I lo shot that first barrage, was press space bar. And he's dead. It just keeps going. I don't think this is ever gonna end. I could probably sit here for an hour and it would still keep going. <laughs> that being said, it's over. I guess the run ending is the only thing that can stop that perpetual motion machine. <laughs> Incredible stuff. Anyway, I hope you've enjoyed yourself as much as I have. And I hope that you uh, will be returning again tomorrow. I accidentally closed the game too quickly. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's it from me for today. I hope you've uh, had fun. Uh, I'll catch you again tomorrow, I suppose. Have a good one. See ya. Bye.